everybody, let's make it pop. It's another learning unit. This is Matthew Reinhardt. We're going to learn a little bit about arthropods and insects. And today we're going to make a pop up about metamorphosis. Um, but let's learn what is metamorphosis. Metamorphosis is Greek for um, change shape. So it's like when insects change from one shape to another as they grow up. All right, there are two types of metamorphosis. There's incomplete and complete metamorphosis. Incomplete metamorphosis consists of three stages, and that, that would be an egg, a nymph, and an adult. And the reason why they call it an incomplete one is because the nymph, the middle form, looks a lot like a miniature adult. The insects that have an incomplete metamorphosis life cycle include true bugs, grasshoppers, cockroaches, termites, praying mantises, crickets, and lice. Ooh. Now, a complete metamorphosis life cycle includes an egg, a larva, a pupa, an adult, and each one of them kind of looks different. They look, they look completely different along the way. Insects with complete metamorphosis life cycles include beetles, bees, ants, butterflies, moths, fleas, and mosquitoes. Ooh, don't let them bite you. All right, let's make our pop-up. All right, let's get started making our metamorphosis pop-up. So first, what you're going to need to do is download the templates down below. There's a link down below. Click on the link, print them out onto 110-pound uh, cardstock or whatever color you want, white or any color, and then let's get started. You're going to see that there's two types of lines uh, on the pop-up. There's a, a solid black line. That's where you're going to cut. But we're going to start on um, the fold lines. We're going to start on scoring all the dotted black lines. See all those dotted black lines? You're going to take a big paper clip, and then you're going to also take a ruler, and you're going to press with the edge of that paper clip along all those dotted lines using your ruler as a straight edge, just like this. So I'm pressing with the um, edge of that paper clip on all those dotted black lines, just like that. So once we've done that, we can start to cutting. All the solid lines, we're going to follow with our scissors along all the solid black lines, and we're going to cut out all the pieces of the pop-up. And you just very carefully cut along all those solid black lines. And, you know, what, what really works best is rather than moving your hand to cut along all those curves, it's even better if you actually turn the paper and let your scissors stay in one position. It works a lot easier. See how that goes? All right, we're going to change this, kind of like a metamorphosis, we're going to change this paper from one form to another. We're going to turn it from paper into a pop-up. All right, now let's pre-fold all the pop-up pieces, all right, just like this. We're just going to pre-fold them, fold it down the center, just like that, of this piece. And this is just going to tell our paper which way to go. So that piece. And let's get on to this piece here. We're just going to fold this little tab going this way, just like that. And we're going to fold these tabs just like this. Now let's fold it down the center here. Now let's fold these, these diagonal lines. We're just going to fold them right there. And there. Look at how that goes in. That's a V-fold. We're going to fold that inward. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. Let's fold this other V-fold. I've taught about V-folds in some of my other um, pop-up videos if you want to check them out. You can learn a lot more about how to make pop-ups, but today we're going to make this really cool. We're going to transform this paper, this simple paper, into a beautiful butterfly. Ooh. Now, let's get to assembling it after we've pre-folded everything. We're going to take some glue, just some regular craft glue. We're going to glue. You're going to see these little um, areas on the base page here. See these little gray spots here? We're going to glue these little tabs here down at the bottom of our pop-up piece there and there. They're going to go just right in that spot. We're going to take the glue. You can use like regular Elmer's glue or whatever craft glue. I, those, those are the best ones. We're just going to sort of squirt it just into that space. Not too much. You don't want a big old puddle because if you do, we're not going to, this whole pop-up will stick to each other. All the pieces will stick to each other. I can't even say that right. We're going to glue these two tabs just in place. See how we've lined that up? One, and two, just like that. All right, let's make sure it's centered properly because that top piece has got to line up as well. Look at there. Look at that gray area right there. That's where that tab goes. Let's put some glue on it and stick that top tab down. There we go. And then make sure to let your other tabs um, dry on the bottom there. Make sure when you build this, it's built flat. You're going to build this pop up flat so that you can get the most movement. Now this piece here, see this little piece? We're going to glue the, the butterfly's body in that space, just like that. So I'm just going to put some glue right in that little gray area. See how it fits just right there? She doesn't put too much either. It goes right, just like that, right on top. 
of that area. Look at that. Let's glue on the back side. See this area here? We're going to put this piece right on top of it. See that? It goes right there on top. Just like that. And there's the, the caterpillar's body. So it's going to change from a caterpillar on the outside to a butterfly. Pop-up butterfly. It's really cool. So let's glue it just in this area. See how we've just filled in that whole space just like that with the glue? Not too much. Press this piece just right on top. That's going to make the um, door to our pop-up, the, the page, a little bit stronger. And it'll also, see the art on there? You can see the caterpillar, so you can color in the caterpillar later on. Um, and decorate the, the butterfly part after you've built the pop-up of our butterfly. Let's see how it works. Let's see how it works. It's dried. It's all ready. So let's close our pop-up. Ooh, look. There's the butterfly inside. Oh, it's a caterpillar on the outside, right? There's the caterpillar. And then when we open it, oh, a butterfly. Oh, it's beautiful. So now you can decorate it. You can, you can do whatever you want. You can add um, any stories you want onto about metamorphosis. But this is a pop-up about metamorphosis. It changes from a caterpillar on the outside to a butterfly on the inside. So that is our pop-up about metamorphosis. This is Matthew Reinhardt saying, see you next time. Oh, don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you like this and you want to see more of these learning units and you have any ideas about them, let me know on social media. I'm on uh, Instagram and uh, 